And I really just wanna, I wanna give my man his flowers right now. This is one of the hardest working brothers in the poetry game right now. Like when I say, uh, every time I see a flyer at a poetry event, he's on like most of them. Every event I go to, he's there. You know what I'm saying? And, and his, his grind, his memorization, I've never seen my guy mess up once. Not only is he a talented poet, not only is he a talented poet, my man is also a dope dancer. He can also sing a little, so he got a little vocals on him, you know what I'm saying? And he also, and he, damn, you know what I'm saying? He begins his little You Got Served doing, you know, I'm limited with the outfit, but you know, um, he has merch that glows in the dark too. I've never seen no shit like it. But overall, he's a dope person, and I know for a fact he's gonna give you an amazing show. Before I bring my man up, I'm gonna need like a little round of, you know what I'm saying? Coming up to the stage right now. The one, the only, his name may be Mellow, but he ain't got no chill when he up here on the stage. Give it up for Mellow Yes, 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 yes. What's up, y'all? <sighs> this feels like home, like a home game. Um, first of all, shout out to the Voices in Power stage. Um, this is different, yo. Like, like you said, I've been around. There's nothing like this. There's nothing like this. Um, before I start, let me just say my daughter's here tonight. And, be, and before I came in, she bought me this. Because I, I spit fire and shit. What? Okay. So I'm not going to do a whole bunch of talking at all. I'm going to kind of get right to it. But um, I need y'all to do me a favor. Whoever is not recording right now, I need volunteers. Like, can y'all actually do this? Like, don't, like, fake it. Can y'all get your phones up for me real quick and go to your, uh, your timers? Like everybody who, who's able. Don't, don't, don't push start till I say it now. All right. I need you to put 17 minutes on that timer, please. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna let you know exactly when. Thank you, yeah, I know, somebody. All right, so. Tonight isn't really about me. This is about the demons that I have. Have I got a lot of old friends in here that have been through a lot of shit. You know what I'm saying? Rick in here, he bailed me out before. Now you remember I got locked up in the joint. Like, I've been through some shit. Car got shot up. Rick was there too. Whatever. So I just need to get some of these demons out. I am now a different man than I was then. And in order for me to transition into the next period, I have to let that shit go. So tonight, I want to try my best to get as many demons out as I can. It might be a little aggressive. I'm sorry. That's how I am. I, I didn't give a fuck. I was just saying it. Um, so what we're going to do is I'm going to do a countdown from five. And after that countdown, we are going to push the button on the timer. Is that cool? Y'all got that? All right. Five, four, three, two, one. Let me explain how I maintain these thresholds of pain. I've walked across the sun barefoot looking for shade. I've placed flowers at a grave of someone I could have saved instead I groveled and prayed instead of making them change. I got feelings that I'm feeling that I'm not allowed to fail. Pain in my voice, but I'm not allowed to yell. Memories of heaven, but I'm trapped in this hell with these people that I miss that I'm not allowed to tell. Y'all see that? That moment right there? We're Nick. See, that moment reminded me of Aunt Viv. Y'all remember that episode where she went and she had to go to that dance audition and she saw them little white bitches and she got all nervous and shit and started sleeping on herself? Y'all remember that? Then she had to go home and reflect. And then she came back and she hit him with the...
Well, I'm about to snap just like that. See, there was something about watching that rich auntie slay that opened up my eyelids to let me know that I ain't no bitch. Who am I? I'm the poet boy that's about to stretch this motherfucker out like the Yogi Jones. Mary Mance tells me I'm too humble. So tonight I'm on my cocky shit. I feel like I'm Trish. Yeah. Nico told me bring that eagle. Tonight I'm going to empty that clip. Happy birthday, T. Sleeveless. Where are you at? Yeah. T. Sleeveless called me OG. So since it's your birthday, it's only right. I'll show you the origins of my gift. Ooh. I'm a monster. And I ain't talking about no cookie, B. Because I'm about to spit. There's a poet in here that I heard whisper some shit about me once. He talked about me like he won't go rounds. That opinion based off of ignorance, boy. Or maybe you just gasped by all your niggas that don't understand that switch you flip by dissing me, boy. We always ready. That's an acronym for the war. You attack him, you get destroyed. Look. Rook, don't waste a night you could have spent with your queen trying to turn from a pawn to a king. They'll give your bishop a call. <laughs> Tell them you made it to the end of this board, but then got slaughtered by the final boss. Them shooters with you on the floor crying like they took a loss in the final fall. It's March. Don't shoot to be shooting. Nigga, you better try to score. Off of image and gimmicks. I hate to have to respond to kid shit. Superman had to fucking take off his jacket to kill a cricket. Y'all know what a cricket is? All that noise from a little friction. Mm -hmm. That's your affliction. This has been religion for me. Welcome to benediction. Pray with me. Our Father, Mellow's a problem starter, bomb dropper, wine waver, dragon slayer, real monster, the lyrical monster, the king of Wakanda, running through the jungle, dumping like them niggas from Concha. I gave women my attention when she just needed a sponsor. Now she can't afford to keep up a fucking Honda. <laughs> Look, real shit. Pick up my phone right now. I got messages from my exes. I never delete it. Never delete it. Telling me that she'd be better if she left, it went a different direction. Get to stepping. Like Martin kicking Gina out of that bedroom, but when you walk away, you won't see me begging. Just don't forget who you left then. I went from wanting to step off that ledge to a legend. From scraping my crumbs to breaking bread with my brethren, I stepped away for a second. Now all these little niggas think they can best them. You must be nuts. Ugh. Now I'm back on my Tommy Shepard. Curriculum built to out flip the bums early. A razor blade under the tongue just like a young birdie. I'm swerving. Mo talk about nothing asking to see me pop lock. Why your girl doing boogaloo moves inside my drop box? I was a dancer, nigga. And them girls thought I was handsome, nigga. She liked the way that I sway. I got the answers, nigga. <laughs> Baby girl, you got some powder on your nose. Try not to make a scene. I used to push that cocaine, same color as an angel's wing. It would take her to the heavens. She would hear the angel sing, uh, maybe it's Maybelline. Nah, not the way it made her lean. I got to take her home because ain't no way that she can drive her. Went from screaming, she's fine, to asleep. When that light turned red bottoms, yellow bone with green in her sight, she throws up on the shoulder of the traffic jam of life. A uh, Molly Poppin' model, hollow VIP bottle. She will fuck you for a bag of kush. I call that pussy pothole. She could have been an activist, but she want that activist, that lean. She only date him six figures. She figures that's a king. Searching for the answers, the questions I want to answer. Thinks she needs a surgery to make it as a dancer. Idea of being pampered is him paying for pampers. Or flying her on spirit from Vegas to Atlanta. Buying her a bottle, letting her sit in sections. Giving her little love, using cash app as affection. Disrespecting our children. In and out of jail. But the victim of the system of the children who had never had a Christmas with their siblings because their baby mama's beefing and the weekends just ain't sinking. When will it sink in? What are we thinking? I'm thinking of a tiny black hand on a prison glass, staring at an angry black man who ain't looking back. Time on his mind, can't rewind or get it back. He's scared that his seed might forget him, or even worse, get attached. 
Funny how greed took his shit, now he looking back, why look forward? Nothing to look forward to, except the same day, on repeat, when the morning sun's every morning sun, he's morning sun, and he got more than one. But that's just everyday shit. Every day is the same shit. I hop in the same whip and listen to the same nigga on the radio selling that same brick. I put the same clip back in the 387 yard while Billy with Hollows is just tomorrow. Daughter, can you get me a water? The day after that's the same as the last. I heckled went backwards. I facing my past. I was raised in the ghetto to say it's a trap. I hate to admit it. My kids are playing in a place you won't visit. What's up, kid? You hear what I say and you'll say I'm explicit, but if you see what I see, you would tell me I'm gifted. It's different if you say that you lived it. I see my nigga get shot. If I tell who did it, then I'm snitching, and if I kill him, you go to prison, you don't live how I'm living. It's different. You watching the news, I ain't watching the news, even on my block on the news. Somebody that's got shot that I knew and a spot that I grew from a boy to a man. The boys in sedans that come and snatch the toys at your hand. If you toy with that man, them boys in sedans that come to foil your plans. Your castle fall like your empire was formed out of sand. Getting money was your deal, but getting booked at your plan. I'm going to show you the thoughts of one man. Come on, My man Chaos did the Who Am I Challenge. And it made me think, who the fuck am I? I am the hunger. I am the prison of living under the limelight that's bright as the lightning before the thunder. I'm the last second of moonlight before the sun's up, just struggling to shine, but it can feel itself dying. I am that stumble right before you crumble. So hard to get up, but it's harder to give up. I am that XO burning holes in your liver. I'm the weed smoke seeping to the bottom of your lungs, being taken out the trunk, slumped down by the river, just bleeding while you plead into the barrel of a gun. Mind on a sparrow, eye on a skrilla, hand on a Bible, finger on the trigger, hollow to your chest shit, lift up like a hiccup, straight through your front, bones crunched like a sit-up, body turned stiffer than a puppet that ain't stringed up, cause all that peace shit just get you Martin Luther Kinged up. I am death at a wedding, birth at a murder scene, crying while you dying here, bloody tears burgundy, looking at a newborn baby, just worrying more about his future than your own. I am nickel-plated chrome to the dome of a man who can't stand here alone, unafraid to make a grave his home if hate is violence. I am full-blown. I will break through silence. I am your song, nigga. I am your quote. I am celebration at the end of segregation. I'm just full of false hope. I am a fiend who believes that he's free after just one more needly fiends and receives and he ODs. I'm the MT who sees that he's empty and tries to revive him with life when he knows that that life is likely for a limited time just till he gets another dime. I'm cousin of a blood. I'm cousin of a crip. I'm son of a bastard. Son of a bitch. I was born alone. I'll die by myself. So I am a man who knows us doesn't exist. I am the suburbs. I am the streets. I am what it sounds like when history repeats. Martin Luther Jones, nigga. Malcolm Mello. Tap the ghetto. I used to wear a snapback that was black and yellow, and under that lot of eyes of a madman. The one in the back of that black caravan when the side door slides back and your eyes catch that mask and you know cash won't cash in for what he asking. I was born in a maze. While these ghosts try to take me away, I can relate to Pac-Man. Bad dreams, no memories of real life. Black screen, melodies, and misery. I can't remember what it feels like to feel like. Jealousy is everywhere. Envy is in everything. My fucking wedding ring was filled with fear because I was scared to be alone. My hollow tips filled with love for life, but it's my own. I'm my own worst enemy. I am my shadow. The real me is following a much darker mellow. Death is a gift when you're trapped in a life you don't like and everything's wrong. Are you sure you're doing right? The preacher told me, son, pray. Everything going to be all right. Who the fuck are you to tell me everything's going to be all right? You're just another nigga. It's like a jungle sometimes. It makes me wonder why somebody would confront a nigga who could bring the thunder with the scratch of a finger. I could flatten a nigga and let a hollow tip defrag in his liver, sit in a bag with a zipper. My nigga hand me the horn like it's a Grammy Award, and I'll be there with a remainder. That means I carry the four. You go ahead and carry that torch, and I'm going to carry that cross. Let your mother know it ain't too late to have an abortion. Look at his lad as an orphan. He learned to rap. It's important. He learned to drastic. His fortune. We see his dad in the car. My nigga start tripping. I could put this to the bottom of your chin and have your top looking like Bart Simpson. Top blown open, soul floating, body fall. I'm the wildest thing since Tone Loke with chrome smoking out his car. And I hop back to plans, large bills wrapped in bands, hit corners, burn rubber in a mat sedan, all leather in that roof rack is tan. 
I don't even need no key. I got an app to unlock them. Vroom, I can't enjoy that I jacked your man. He tried to reach for the door, and I saw, so I clapped his hand like an audience. I'm raunchy as the trash from cans, and I can switch seize your head like a Packers fan and hell the smoke. Niggas think that Mel's a joke until he fell and choked with his pelvis broke. See, I unveiled from a velvet rope. Top secret, a long clock in his post. You shit, stop fucking sleeping. They used to think I'm Puerto Rican. Pretty guy, 5'9", brown eyes, sell Achilles till I get my city high, speed limit 55. But I'm hitting pretty high, headed while I drive, throw a break with the pretty eyes. Niggas, want to kill me? Why? Because when it semi slide, I can turn your chest into mini blinds. And all this pain, I couldn't talk about it, I couldn't get it out. So I just got more and more and more tattoos just to get that pain from the inside out. My body is filled with black ink, blood of a black man who won't bleed when he's cut deep. See, my skin won't slice, break, or bend. My wounds grew within, but only a few in this room know that these stories I'm talking are actually fucking true. My imagination's only outrageous to the ones in here that are strangers, see? But the strangers are the only ones that notice my danger. You stand too close, you can't distinguish the picture. That's exactly why I distance from niggas. You see me clear when you don't look. Any of y'all old enough to remember those magic eye books? That's just an example how your image gets scrambled. A lot of y'all don't know me. You just know who I hand you. I give you confidence when the one to confide in. I talk loud as fuck to break out my mind's deafening silence. I sing other nigga songs because my songs don't sound right. Life gave me lemons, so in front of y'all, I hide in this limelight. If everything happens for a reason, then what's the reason I'm lonely? Even when I'm with all my homies. I wonder if everybody feels like I'm still me and hasn't seen I'm changed. Maybe I'm not the real me. I got people in here, right? Y'all feel me, right? Y'all want to respect them. But on the other end of the spectrum, some trying to kill me. I wake up and give God his praise and see the scars on my hand when I wash my face. I wrote half this in a cell when I caught my case. Even after I beat it, I still feel defeated. This black ink, that's tears of a man who won't cry. Because I cry inside, look through my eyes, who am I stressed trying to make sense of suicide? Life's a game. And if you don't play, you can't win, right? But on the other end, if I don't play, I can't lose. How can I choose when there's no choice? It's like everything I do here has no point. Life makes me want to scream. But as a black man in America, I feel like I have no voice. So I choose black ink. That's the eyes of a man who just wants you to see what you can. I know times is hard, but remember, when he draws your car, you can't dance with the devil and walk with God and still stand as a man. That would take six feet. Shit, that's deep. On the beach, one set of footprints on the sand. But they start at size 3 and end size 10, which means I've been all alone since I was a kid. I know I had to have a halo floating over my head or I'd be dead. Lord, please let me lead. I don't want to be led. Bad dreams feel like thorns in my bed. Because I was raised in a bed of concrete roses. Life's a little bit of love and a lot of moments. When it's all said and done, it's still never over. I'm an angel, but I'm draped in this devil's clothing. And it feels like it's almost over. Because I don't know about y'all, but when I go outside, it just feels like the fucking end of days. Look how we went from kings and queens to slaves, from afros to braids to waves to locks to braids to waves to froze again. The same tree you knock down, seed grows again as reproduction. Every wrong move has repercussions. Every last bee buzzing, fish swimming, has a reason for being. Every human, a reason for breathing. A reason for seeing the shit you see daily, so keep your eyes open. Don't be another man who died hoping. An uh, innocent child tried smoking, nearly died choking. He's copying the block because his pops locked up and his sister knocked up. Sixteen, scared I had a kid, and she ain't really sure who that baby's daddy is. We went from bragging by the chains around her neck, dragging by the chains around her neck, just trying to get respect from rocking for debt to getting a check. From having self-respect to none, we self-protect with our guns, neglect our lungs, filled with black smoke we attack hope tie it down grab it by the throat and choke stack coke by the pound just to sell to our own fucking people america's mascot ain't no damn eagle it's a fat white man with some crack in a baseball bat i bet you get smacked with a bat after he sneaks up behind you and the crack be stuffed in your jacket when the cops find you it's all a setup how long the game gonna last i give a glare and a laugh to the american flag the red is for the indigenous who lost their lives and died trying to get a piece of that pie the white for the man in power the color that's gonna constantly surround you from the crack you chop to when your casket drop you see the blue is for the cops they get the stars boxed in we're never free even if we roll 50 deep we stay in line only then can we fly high these lazy eye guys watch while time flies by it stops for no man inmate flashback guns both hands ready to kill a grown man he only 17 he loved the lakers he wanted to be the next kareem but his simple dreams got overpowered by that triple beam see that life was hectic ignorance and anger form a weapon it's called a fury he still ain't sure what happened it's kind of blurry but one man in the cemetery he in the penitentiary his memory years ago 
15 years ago, 5,000 tears ago, a 32-year-old man below the system. All his friends and family forget to miss him. Gradually, he stops to listen to his heartbeat. He can't feel it. Life of concrete, eyes to the ceiling. I wonder if there's a God or not. The strength of a man can never stop the hands of a clock. So it ticks and it talks and we watch. And we do shit and buy shit and sell shit and fuck each other over and do shit that gives our people no stock. But shit, when I got my fucking check, I invested in my neck. I wanted some reparations for the way they left me fucking hanging. Damn it, I needed VVS to release some stress. Ironic how I try not to seem depressed by making decisions that could put me in debt. Creating a target that could just lead to death right over the lungs in which I need for breath. Something they resent with me every step. Knowing that I frequent with them demons crept. Them same demons that stop heartbeats for less. Centuries of feeling weak got me on my knees. This piece is just my need to flex. Bitch, give me baguettes. I'm talking stones that's as large as the tomb in which Jesus slept. Maybe I wanted the next one in a cross in which Jesus wept. But maybe that cross was just a myth. And if you really dig deep into the true history books, they tell us that Jesus was hung just like the rest of us. That cross was just man-made stories, no glory. No matter how fucking long I stand on this stage, I'll never have enough time. A poet leaves the room and his demons leave with him. The only thing that happens is we run out. Thank you. Uh, if y'all wanted to follow me, y'all can follow me at Mellow Jones underscore. Uh, when poets ask for followers, that's like our currency. Or like corporations really look at us like, oh, you only have this many followers. You must be trash. So when an artist asks you, that's why we're asking. We're not, you know. Thank y'all.